guys welcome back okay so today i wanted to play in a new little collection that came out from bh cosmetics i got it in the mail last week or this past weekend don't remember but i did order this collection when it first dropped a few weeks ago but of course with shipping i just got it not too long ago and it's called the midnight festival collection it comes with this palette and the packaging on the palette is really cute. If you can see when I shift it, it has like fireworks that show, you know, it kind of has like that shift packaging where you can see one thing and then see another. So very, very cute. I like the pink and the green mixture. On the back, it does have some information regarding this palette and whatnot but and it comes in a sleeve as well i don't have the sleeve but it has a little sleeve that it comes in and this is what this palette looks like okay super bright super colorful i mean i think it's really really cute there is a mirror in here and as you can see it does have like fireworks around the mirror but these are the colors in this palette <laughs> you guys very very bright neon it's um shadows as well as pressed glitters very very pretty and just looking at this palette right now i'm like what am i doing today i have no idea but of course it's going to be very bright and possibly glittery okay so yeah very very pretty bright palette in this collection they also dropped this little duo of plumping lip glosses this is what the packaging looks like let me open it up so i can show it to you so these are called the Midnight Festival So Extra High Shine Lip Gloss Duo. So this is what they look like, very pretty. I will swatch these for you when the time comes for me to do my lips. Now, I'm looking at the website right now and I know when I bought the set, the collection, it was on sale. It's still 25% off at the time that I'm doing this video, so just FYI. Lastly, um, it does come with a brush set, the Midnight Festival brush set, and it's a 10-piece brush collection with a brush holder as well. But this is the box, very, very cute. It has some information on the back as well, and it does list all of the brushes that you get in this cute little collection on the back. Sorry if you hear the AC, it might be kicking on and kicking off. <laughs> but this is what the brushes look like, okay? So, so cute. If you like pink, then this is a brush set for you, okay? But it has a BH logo on the front, cute little plastic holder, and these are the brushes that come in this set. So as you can see, it's a little variety. Some face brushes, some eye brushes. It's kind of an interesting mix of brushes, if you ask me um yeah it doesn't have like all the brushes that i would love in a brush set but it's cute enough but let me go ahead and give you a closer look the ferrule has kind of like a gradient or you know fading pink look to it so so pretty the brushes do have brush numbers on them and this one as you can see is like an angled fluffy brush so yeah they're very very nice brushes i love bh cosmetic brushes so i'm pretty sure i will really enjoy using them but like i said it's kind of like a different mixture of brushes than ones that i would necessarily pick you know like there's no like big fluffy brush and i don't know but anyways i might use some of these i might not but it's really really cute okay so i'm gonna go ahead prep my lids and then we'll jump into this super bright palette Okay, you guys, so I did prep my lids with my P. Louise base. I do want to go ahead and swatch this palette before I get started just so I can get an idea of how these shadows are going to swatch and what they look like. So let's do some quick swatches.
Okay, so this is the whole palette swatched. I have all of the mattes and shimmers here on my arm. And then I did go ahead and swatch the glitters separately on my hand. So those are really, really pretty. Very, very pretty. And they look like they are adhering nicely without any type of glitter glue. Of course, I would definitely suggest using a glitter glue whenever you use glitter. The mattes seem to be decently pigmented. The shimmers are absolutely gorgeous though. This one here, this green one, looks like it kind of has like a shift in it. I don't know, it could just be my eyes, but very, very pretty. Okay, so let's see what I can come up with for this palette. Okay, so I think I wanna start out with the pink shade here, and it's called Main Stage. Very nicely pigmented. And you guys, I have no idea what kind of eye look I want to do. <laughs> when it comes to bright palettes like this, I usually just kind of jump in and wing it because I want to see colors all over my eyes. And also, I try to just use as many colors as possible so you guys can really get a feel for the pigmentation. So I'm just going to start throwing color on my eyes if that's okay with you guys. Okay, very nice. Next, I wanna go into this gorgeous purple shade and just place that right next to the pink. Now I'm just going to go into this lighter shade here so I can blend out the edge of that pink and purple. It's kind of like a light lavender from what I'm seeing. But I wanna use that to kind of soften up that edge so it's not so harsh. Okay, so next I want to go into this gorgeous blue shade here and tap that right next to the purple. And I'm just going to try to blend that blue into that purple a little bit. And I'm doing more of a tapping motion before I blend, just to make sure I get that pigment down nice and deep. These colors are just so, so pretty. I'm like, oh my gosh, these are gorgeous. Okay, so since this is a festival palette, I definitely want to incorporate some of this shimmery green and one of these glitters. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and lay down some of this shimmery green and I'm not gonna cut my crease. I'm going to cut my crease with the shimmer. Hopefully it works. These shimmers look very nicely pigmented, but I am going to go ahead and spray my brush just to see if that will help it out with the shine. Okay, very, very nicely pigmented. Just a little spray on the brush and it is very, very vibrant, very pretty. So now I'm just going to go and tap a little bit more of that blue in the outer corner, just covering up a little bit of that green shimmer and a little bit of purple. Now I'm just going to clean up around my eyes a little bit, put on some black eyeliner, and then I'm gonna try out one of these glitters. I changed my mind, you guys. Instead of going in with a black liner, I'm going to go in with a colored liner. This is like a bright pink liquid liner that I have from Handayan. So I'm gonna see how this looks. Okay, you guys, so I went ahead and put on some of that bright pink liner. <laughs> now I wanna go into one of these glitters. So I'm gonna take this one here 
and just tap a little bit of that on top of where I put that green shimmer. But I'm going to use a little bit of my NYX glitter glue before I place the glitter down. Okay, you guys, so I went ahead, added that glitter on my lid, and I actually really like it. I think it's very, very pretty. It's interesting with these glitters because they don't necessarily, it's weird. Like, in the camera, the glitter that I used, it definitely looks like it's turquoise, but when you're looking at it, like me looking at the palette, it looks purple. It's really weird. So yeah, it's like these glitters have a really pretty combination of different colors in them. And this one I think is like turquoise and purple. So it's giving me a lot of different colors in this glitter. So anyways, let me go ahead, finish up my complexion, come back and then we'll finish up this look. Okay, so now I want to go ahead and finish up my eyes. My complexion is done. So for my lower lash line, um, you know what? I want to go in with a colored liner. I think I'm going to go in with maybe a blue liner. I told you guys I'm just winging it, okay? So don't come for me if I look like a festival splash, okay? <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna go in with this cobalt blue eyeliner from Profusion. I really like how that blue looks, so I think I'm going to go ahead, take some more of this blue and just kind of put a little bit of that on my lower lash line as well. Now I want to take a little bit of this purple shimmer and just put that in my inner corner. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead, pop on some lashes and some mascara, and then we can try out one of these lip glosses. Okay you guys, so for the lip glosses, I guess there are two different sets of, you know, duos for the lip glosses. So the duo that I got is actually called Plur, whatever that means, Plur. <laughs> and so this first shade here is Riot, which is the darker, lip gloss and this one which is the lighter glittery one is called sequin so i'm gonna go ahead and swatch the darker one so i'm just gonna swatch it on my hand so you can see what it looks like okay so that is the shade riot very pretty and this is the shade sequin so you can see those really pretty kind of lavender type glitters in there very, very pretty. I think I'm gonna use that one, the lighter shade with the glitters in it. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with one of my NYX lip liners. And this lip gloss has a pretty big doe foot applicator, which is nice. Oh, it smells good. <laughs> it smells like candy. If you like lip gloss, it smells like candy. You'll like this. So it's a very nice light gloss. It feels very comfortable. It's not heavy or sticky or anything. It smells really good. And it feels good on my lips as well. So I guess you can just put it on without a lip liner if you want. You don't have to line your lips with this. I just wanted that little extra, you know, security around my lips and to add a little bit of color. I like it, it's pretty. <laughs> 
So this is it you guys. This is the look for this Midnight Festival palette from BH Cosmetics. I must say it is nicely pigmented. <laughs> I would have to say this is a BH Cosmetics palette that I think is really, really nice. If you like bright colors, you're gonna love this. And if you like glitter and shimmer, you're gonna love this as well. I mean, there are only the four pressed glitters, which, you know, is enough. But if you don't like the glitter, even the rest of the palette, the mattes and the shimmers, very, very pretty as you can see. Nicely pigmented and is great for someone who likes bright colors. So I like this palette. I like this whole collection actually, even though I didn't use the brushes, I'm kind of like a brush collector anyway. So I typically use my favorite brushes. Even if I buy a brush set, try it out. I usually gravitate to the same brushes. So brush set is very, very cute though. <laughs> it is very, very cute. I like the lip glosses, everything. So I think this is a very cute collection if you're interested in it. I don't think you'll be disappointed if you pick it up. I like it, I think it worked out pretty well. So that's it you guys. Thanks so much for hanging out with me to try out this BH Cosmetics Midnight Festival collection. And I will see you on my next video. Toodles.